Did you know that a big construction caused a big confusion? So come with me. Let's open the great book. Do you remember what happened in Noah's Ark story that we told you here at the great book? If you haven't watched it yet, as soon as this video ends, get its link in the description box, because today's story takes place right after that heavy rain. In those times, everyone in the world spoke the same language. Yes, that's right. The people from Noah's family grew in number, and they gathered in cities that were getting bigger and bigger because the Lord had given them the instructions to spread all over the land. One day, they had an idea. If we get together, we can build something great. What if we made a tower that could reach the heavens? Can you imagine that? Everyone would see that we are important. So they started to build the tower. They used a special type of brick because the tower was going to be very, very high. They really wanted to reach the heavens. Those people's hearts were full of vanity and pride, and the Lord did not like that at all. After all, His instructions were to spread all over the land, and they were doing the opposite. So, God decided to go to that city to check out the tower they were building. When he arrived there, he noticed that they worked together as a team to build something to exalt themselves, their pride and vanity. So he said, They are one people and speak the same language, and they are building this. Soon, nothing is going to stop them. So, let's do this. Let's confuse their language so that they don't understand each other anymore. At that moment, something totally unexpected happened. One of the workers spoke to his workmate, and his face was puzzled. He really couldn't understand what his workmate said. And when he said he didn't understand, his workmate was the one with the puzzled face. He also couldn't understand anything. And this is what happened to all workers there. Each one was speaking a different language, and they could not communicate anymore. This caused a big confusion in that construction, and everyone stopped working, and they all spread. With time, people who spoke the same language found each other, and they gathered to make a new community, and this is the way the people and the languages spread all over the earth. This is why the city was called Babel, that means a mix of languages, because the Lord confused their languages and spread the people all over the earth. Amazing! Did you notice that pride and vanity lead us to the opposite of what God asks us to do? Every day we need to ask God to be humble and to live a life of obedience. This is the best way to go! Did you have fun? So press the like button and subscribe. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram. See you soon. Bye!